Well, hello, it's Miss Gina. How are you on this rainy Saturday? You're at story time with Miss Gina. Hello, I'm Miss Gina. And you're at Gina's Planet. And we're gonna read Goldilocks and the Three Bears tonight. Yeah. So I'm glad you're here. So Pooh Bear wanted to listen. So it's Goldilocks and the Three Bears. Goldilocks is the little girl in front with the blonde hair. And there's three bears standing behind her and there's a little house. What do you think this story might be about? And there's our title page, Goldilocks and the Three Bears. And it had a lovely front cover, didn't it? There's the back cover. That's the spine of our book. And the Three Bears and Goldilocks are our main characters. Once upon a time. Once upon a time, yes. It's a very lovely little cottagey house. Can you smell that? I've had the doors open all day. You can smell the rain. This looks fresh. There were three bears, three. A great big papa bear, a middle-sized mama bear, and a little baby bear. One morning, Mama Bear made some porridge for breakfast, but it was much too hot to eat. The three bears decided to go for a walk while their porridge cooled on the table. So they've decided to go for a walk and let their food cool off. They've made some porridge. Nearby in the forest, a young girl named Goldilocks was picking flowers. As she wandered about, she saw the cozy little cottage that was the home of the three bears. She knocked, then she tried to tried the front door and found that it was not locked. It was not locked. It's open are unlocked. Goldilocks entered the door and saw the three bowls of porridge on the table. Oh, I am very hungry and it smells so good. The little girl said out loud. She tasted a spoonful of porridge from the big bowl and said, this is much too hot. She tried the big bowl. Then she took a bite from the middle bowl of porridge and said, this is much too cold. So she's now tasted the middle bowl and she thinks it's too cold. Then she took a spoonful out of the smallest bowl. Mmm, she said, this one is just right. And she ate up all the porridge. Yum. So she tried those and they were too hot and too cold. And the little bitty bowl was just right. And she drank it all up. She ate it all up. It looks like she drank it and she got her bowl turned up. So she liked that one. It was perfect. Goldilocks saw three chairs by the fireplace. She thought, I am very tired and I would like to rest by the warm fire. There's the chairs. First, she sat in Papa Bear's chair. This chair is much too big, she cried. There she is in Papa Bear's chair. 
Right here's Papa. There's Mama. That's Baby. She next sat in Mama Bear's chair and said, This chair is much too soft. Then she sat in the smallest chair that belonged to Baby Bear and said, oh, this chair is just right. Suddenly the chair leg snapped and she fell to the floor with a bang. There she is. She sat in those. They were too, what were they? Too big and too soft. Yep, much too big and much too soft. And then this one was good, except it broke. She was too big for it, maybe. It broke. She said it was just right before it broke. Then Goldilocks thought, I am very tired and I would like to take a nap. She climbed the stairs to find a place to rest and found three beds. She first tried Papa's, Papa Bear's bed. This bed is much too hard, she said. It's much too hard. Then she tried Mama Bear's bed and said, this bed is much too soft. Papa's is the big green one. Mama's is the gold and pink one down here. And now I bet she's gonna try Baby Bear's bed next. Next, Goldilocks lay on Baby Bear's bed. Ah, oh, this bed is just right, she said. And she fell fast asleep. Oh, did you see her fast asleep? She did. She fell fast asleep. There's the other beds. Knocked over an expo. There it is. our page. Just about that time, the three bears headed home from their walk. They knew right away that someone had been in their cottage. Uh-oh. They left a mess, didn't they? Someone has been eating my porridge, said Papa Bear. Someone's been eating my porridge, said Mama Bear. Baby Bear said, Someone has been eating my porridge, and look, it's all gone. The three bears walked over to the fireplace. Someone has been sitting in my chair, said Papa Bear. Baby Bear said, Someone has been sitting in my chair, and look, it's all broken. The three bears quietly went up the stairs. Papa Bear took one look at his bed and said, Someone has been sleeping in my bed. Mama Bear said, Someone has been sleeping in my bed. Baby Bear said, Someone has been sleeping in my bed, and look, there she is. There she is. Suddenly, Goldilocks woke up from her nap and saw the three bears. They don't look happy, do they? Ooh, what kind of emotion is Papa Bear showing? He looks a little angry. She jumped out of the bed and went down the stairs as fast as she could and ran right out the door 
and the three bears never saw Goldilocks again. Oh, look, they're having some more porridge. They look happy. Maybe it was just right this time. The end. The end. That was a good story. I hope you liked that story. I hope you enjoyed it. Remember to read more in 2024. And I want you to grow your brain. Wow, grow your brain. And so I'll see you next time. I'm glad you came by and I hope you'll come back. See you next time. Bye-bye.